Hello, my name is Abe and welcome to Shovel Knight Treasure Trove, which I believe is all of the Shovel Knight games built into one package. I've never played Shovel Knight before. I've barely even seen Shovel Knight, except I know it's like Mega Man-ish styled, we have a shovel. Let's play some Shovel Knight. I think it's, I think it's about time for a sort of pseudo platforming adventure and it's been asked of me for quite some time. New game. We're gonna play a new game here. The Shovel of Hope. Dig your way through the main storyline. Plague of Shadows, toss bombs in this tricky alternate quest. Specter of Torment, slice and dice through the tragic prequel. King of Cards, match brains and brawn in this regal prequel. Well, we're gonna be playing the main game. Back X, confirm A. Confirm. Shovel Knight and the Shovel of Hope. Register your name. Okay, I mean, I thought start would, uh, you know, confirm that, but that's okay. Enter body swap mode. Before you begin, would you like to swap the bodies of any characters in the main cast? You can perform this action at any time in the pause menu. So you can play as any skin you want. No, I do not want a body swap. I will play as Mr. Shovel Man himself. Okay, confirm. Choose his profile. Lots of, lots of confirm starting a new game. I've heard nothing but good things about Shovel Knight, so this is gonna be a good, fun experience, I hope. Long ago, the lands were untamed and roamed by legendary adventurers. Of all heroes, none shone brighter than Shovel Knight and Shield Knight. But their travels together ended at the Tower of Fate when a cursed amulet wrought a terrible magic. When Shovel Knight awoke, the tower was sealed and Shield Knight was gone. His spirit broken, a grieving Shovel Knight went into a life of solitude. But without champions, the land was seized by vile power, the Enchantress and her order of no quarter. Hey, three of those characters were on the character select screen. Now the tower is unsealed and devastation looms. A new adventure is about to begin. Ready, player one, start. I am here. I am the shovel man. I have a shovel attack. I can jump. I assume if I uh, downwards attack on something, it would probably uh, allow me to pogo. I, I know, the only thing I know about this game is that pogoing is probably gonna be a resource of some sort. I shovel for gems. I pogo on enemies. That's, that's what I know about this game. <laughs> I will explode the the scrabs. Connie says Cat Jam, such a banger. It is a, a great soundtrack from what I, I've heard people talk about. Hopefully it's loud enough as well. At least, uh, you know, when this goes up on YouTube, I can always adjust there. But you in chat live can let me know if it needs to be louder, because I can make it any, I can increase it, I can decrease it. I can do anything, I can do it all. Sherbert in chat says, composed by Jake Kaufman. I, I've known one Kaufman in my life. Okay, well I gotta know. I'm waiting, I'm looking for secrets. What? This is probably a checkpoint. There we go. I would love to find like all sorts of secrets. You can't jump off of ladders. Classic, you know, older video game thing, I think. I wanna get as much money as possible. What do you think? You think we can bounce on spikes? Probably not. Dun, dun, dun. Same guy did the tunes for Necrodancer, says Connie. That's interesting because Necrodancer is very much. Alright, okay. Necrodancer is very much about the music. 
So it makes sense to me that someone good at music would be making the music for that game, right? This is like absolutely Mega Man. <laughs> I mean, like, I, I understand literally it's, it's Mega Man. You know, that's what they're going for, but also like this is Mega Man. A, a big room with one big enemy in it that has nothing else in it. Yeah, that's Mega Man. That's what it looks like. Now I understand what it looks like to break a wall. It's got a crack in it on the third tile. Stephonics Dorf, welcome! Is this Abe's first time playing Shovel Knight? Yes, it is. As a matter of fact, how'd you know? Stephonics Dorf says, I couldn't get into the game for so long. The first retro, retro platformer I loved was The Messenger, and then I was looking for more, and Shovel Knight was fun all of a sudden. When you figured out how, how the game plays, Yes, it can be fun. Do I need to like deal with his skull at all? I don't know. There's a musical note. There's money there. I don't know what the musical note does, but you know, we got the, Ooh, wait a minute. What the heck is this? Just a big boulder. We got whatever it was. We unlocked it. You can destroy the checkpoints for score if you're greedy enough since Connie is the only thing I know of this game. That's interesting. I probably won't do that, because I'm I would I would like to live. I want to live! Hold on. Hold on. Good! Oing. Thank you. Why did you come back to life? 200. Also, I know wall chickens. I've played video games before. Honey says Mega Man X DuckTales. That's a game I haven't played before. It's interesting playing a game like this that is like purely uh, melee focused, you know? What's gonna happen when we fight bosses? We're gonna have to get up close to him to hit him, aren't we? Boink. Let's see. It's like clearly there's gonna be something there, right? Seafish Roll says I played this recently. You plan on playing the other ones or just Shovel of Hope? I have no, I have no idea. I have never played a Shovel Knight game before. I have played Mega Man games before. What? Do you think this is my first rodeo? But if I like the game and other people like watching it, I will definitely play the other ones. I don't see why I wouldn't. What? Don't. Oh, oh. Okay, hold on. It's another, uh, another piece of the. What? What is? What is it called? A a. Orchestra of music. <laughs> what is it called in the SCP universe? The uh, the ballad that is never finished. You see it and you just want to try to finish it with your own blood. Hello, friend. The money is temporary. Oh God, we gotta go get that. Thirty-five says Nambi. Well, I I don't remember the number. I also don't remember the name, but that one. Yo, how do we get this? Games, you know, putting secrets in front of my face and saying, don't you dare go for them. Of course I'm gonna go for the secrets. Nice. We have 2888 gold. I have no idea what you spend the gold on. I'm assuming we will discover that after the first level. I don't know if it's gonna be level select or if there's actually gonna be a, uh, I don't know if it's gonna be a level select or if it's going to have a, uh, like, hub world. No freaking idea, man. I can bend my knees ever so slightly. <laughs> Hello, dragon. Careful of the hole. Whoa! As soon as I said it. Do, 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 do. 
get out of here. What the heck happened there? See, Fisher Roll says, was the one you didn't love, sorry, was the one you didn't, you didn't like was Plague of Shadows. <laughs> I assume you're talking to Stephonic Storm. I, uh, I don't know. I will discover which ones I like, like, like. Hope I like, like all of them. I like, like you, Jet. Skull's got those wall jumps. Skull was very wall jumpy, wasn't he? I'm assuming that the pots are, oh my god, so many freaking slimes. I'm assuming the pots are like a, uh, a heal pot or something. Maybe it's just money. Dude, not only pogos, Shovel Knight here is hops. It's gotta be another secret here somewhere. My my secret loot senses are tingling right now. You know what? Hold on. Secret behind a secret. Souls me. Souls me. No, no souls me. That will that will forever be a souls in my opinion. When you have a secret behind a secret behind a secret behind a secret. I'm sure other guys did it first, but uh, that's that's one I will always remember. Hey, Lydia, welcome. Oh, look, they made the guy from Dead Cells his own game. <laughs> this is part of my uh, my desire to play through all of the referenced games from Dead Cells. What did I play last? I forget which one I played last, but now we're on Shovel Knight. Black Knight, I knew you'd show your face sooner or later. The Cerulean coward. Turn back, Shovel Knight. You hear that little pop? It was like my headphones popped. Like there's some static electricity happening. I gotta, I gotta figure out the power setup to my computer because it's. I feel like static has been coursing through my my power supply or something. Turn back, Shovel Knight. There's nothing here for you anymore. Shovel Knight, we have a voice. What the heck? Stand aside, Black Knight. I've no quarrel with you. I must return to the Tower of Fate. Your time away has dulled your senses. Can't you see? This entire valley has been conquered by the Enchantress and her invincible knights of the Order of No Quarter stand between you and the Tower. But none of that matters now. Because anyone after the Enchantress has to go through me. Steal thy shovel. Boss is six health. Ow! He hit me. Hey, come here. What? When do I get power moves? Hey, come here. Hey, come here. Oh, come on. I'm noticing um, when I uh, get hit, it doesn't, oh, you son of a, it doesn't actually cost me a full bar of health. It costs me like half of a bar of health. Beat accomplished, I'm alive. Recently, too, I'll get to it eventually, says Lydia. Um, Shovel Knight? I was asked to play this one. But this has been something that's been on my to do list for a long time. Catch her? Oh! For once, Lydia, I'll be in front of you playing one of these games. I still have to play through Blasphemous. Oh, we get to wake him up from his his lovely dream? I don't want to wake up Shovel Knight. Oh, shield maiden. Oh, your shield is so round. Oh. 
mean. Feet accomplished. Only you. I mean, we gotta do what we do. Can we keep digging? Can we, like, dig down to China? Stephonic Store says, I love Blasphemous. Oh, it's a... <laughs> I didn't expect this type of a map. We're playing uh, Super Mario Brothers now. Stephonic Store, I'm looking forward to playing Blasphemous. I need to play that at some point. I would recommend, if you haven't played it yet, and Lydia, I'm gonna recommend this to you as well. Check out Bloody Hell. It's a free Metroidvania on Steam. It's very short, you can play through it in one day, but it's very good for it being free. Bloody hell. Bloody hell. Bloody hell. Plane's clear. Total. Info. Whoops! That's not what I meant to click on. My bad, hold on. Yeah, I know. Let's go back to the map. Relics. Oh, shovel blade! This unusual weapon requires great skill to master. Your original armor, simple but sturdy. Music sheets. Returned 0 of 46 to return to visit the bard to return them. Okay. No, that's... Try that. There we go. Body swap. Feats. Return to map. Okay. There's nothing here. Any secrets? Any secrets? Can we go back? No, we cannot go back. Now, I don't know why the musical note is, is blinking at the bottom. We have to find the bard, I guess. <laughs> Ferals. No, that's their name. <laughs> halt! No weapons. We have enough to worry about lately without everyone swinging swords around. Oh, haha, that's no weapon. Just a shovel. You may enter then. And don't forget, press up to talk to everyone! Dear lady, <laughs> I remember before the Order of No Quarter when we weren't afraid to walk around like this. Why are they walking around like this then? Hey, I remember you. Where is that red knight you used to hang out with? There's a secret in Pri Pride Moor. Keep going left. First is right. I was no trouble, warrior. I want to. I want to talk to Purple Deer. Have you met the Truple Knight? He's quite the character, ho ho ho. Okay. Cannot go through doors? Can I smack people with my shovel? No, okay. It's the bard! Hail traveler, I am but a simple bard, but I have a big problem. I've lost all my musical sheets. My entire repertoire lays scattered across the land. If you ever find a musical sheet, return it to me and I shall reward thee handsomely. Whoa, you have two. Take 500 for each? Sure, wonderful. Let's see here. Oh, you found the rival. Black Knight has fine musical taste. Should have studied composition, but then I suppose I'd be the one with the rival. Now that I have this musical sheet, I can perform it for you at any time, just to ask. We can change the, the music. Molly, you've got a pretty face. You should come visit often. I like to look nice on my day off. You are a horse. I'm afraid I'm gonna run out of health. I gotta get a meal ticket. Pottage and poultry, molten and meat. Your maximum health will increase if you eat. Bring a meal ticket, I'll whip up a feast. Gotitian might have some. Now where's that sly beast? Want more use of your relics? Ah, uh, yes, of course, I can increase your maximum magic. No relics? Oh, you have to find some first. Chester down the ladder, he always has the weirdest things. Gotitian. Ah, decisions, decisions. Should I extend my magic or health or just eat a tin can? Why? Not buy a meal ticket and help but narrow my options. The gastr gastronomer to upgrade your health. I mean, we have the money for it. Feat accomplished. First purchase. Meal ticket? I'll dazzle your palate in no time or less, so bon appetit and bought in the mess. He's a rhyming chef. Open up. There we go. One life container. Beautiful. Juice made. Ah, new face. Dancers, acolytes, witches, goats. Everyone's welcome in here. Oh, that specter knight. If someone could defeat him, I would bestow upon them my greatest treasure. 
Grandma Swamp. Double Trouble Soil and Shovel. My third eye knows your useless infos. Excavatio. The number of dig piles you've dug is seven. The amount of gold you've collected is 6,000. The number of times you've fallen in a battle is zero. Total time you've spent adventuring. Come back for more useful facts. Thanks for helping me. Kindly witch. I'm not a witch. Deposed king. Oh, woe is me, the king of nothing. Not to rule, but my lone bar stool. King Knight sits on Pridemore's throne. That gilded goon, he'll get his soon. Hello, my fine lady. Mona. Sigh, I suppose peaceful solitude is too much to ask for. Well, as long as I'm stranded here, shall we pass the time with a little game? I'll just need a hundred gold. Why not? I'll conjure up some things and, and you can hit them all towards the target for points. What the frick? Okay. You get one for the for the low one, three for the high one. That's like a combo score. What the heck is this? Oh. Look, we at least got one point for that one. How long does this go for? Also, what do I get for doing this? Hold on. Also, what's the high score? I need uh, abilities, because if I had abilities, I bet you I could get more more points. Sherbert says, my online name for a while was Triple King. <laughs> was it based off of Shovel Knight? Metafusion, welcome back. You got 140, good job, I guess. Take this and come back if you get bored again. All right, well, we made a profit. What a weird game. Croker. Hey, Shovel Knight, I know things are tough, but don't throw in the trowel. What? Triple Acolyte. Hello, fish friend. All hail the Triple King. Who? You've never heard of the Triple King? Half trout, half apple? Pronounced like mouthful? Trowpel? Trowpel, not Trouple, Trowpel. He's one of the forest gods here to help those in need. I'm telling the truth. If you ever visit the sacred grotto, hold your chalice aloft and the Trouple King will appear. As it happens, I have been entrusted to sell Trouple chalices to Breliever. To Breliever. Breliever. I'm going to stop now. Would you like one? I guess we can have two. Vessel for storing mythical ichor, but where to find it? I guess we'll, we can hold two, probably. Chester. Psst. Hey, blue guy, you couldn't believe the merchandise I've got for you today. Why not have a look? Oh, well, could have had a little bit more money. Chaos Sphere Fishing Rod. I guess we'll start with the fishing rod. Hold up and press X, cast into a pit, and wait for a bite. Keep an eye out for sparkling fishing spots. Okay. Let's get the heck out of here. This is a terrible place for a bar. You've got to climb in and out every time you uh, want to go for a drink. Oh, she lost her hoop. Nice stick. Come on, let's play. Got your hoop! Got your hoop! All right, that's actually like really cool and cute. <laughs> we get to play hoops. I was kind of hoping she would go into the other room to get it, but nope. Hedge farmer. Are you really the Shovel Knight? Prove it by digging up this dirt. Wow, incredible, you really are Shovel Knight. Oh, okay, well. You know these glass checkpoints? You can break them for treasure, but if you do, they stop being checkpoints. I love living in a village. It's the best. The best. Have you heard of the Trouple King? <laughs> what a terrible name. 
Bottomless pit sparkle, fish in them, gotcha. We might have to go back to the previous level then in order to fish. These buckets are heavy. Turkeys and apples can restore your life. I just found this out, so I'm telling everyone. I'm the fastest, no one can outrun me. This guy is actually like kind of slow, isn't he? Shovel Knight, many trials await you, don't despair. May each defeat strengthen your resolve. I mean, here's what I think. Oh, I was gonna use this to bounce off of, but I can't do that. Instead. Wait, how did I get up there? <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Oh! On her back! Hey, come here, lady. I, I didn't notice that I landed on her back previously. These things sure are heavy, aren't they? I am, I'm also just robbing this village. I'm the bad guy. Okay. Pride more keep, layer of King Knight. The Trowpel Pond. The Lich Yard, layer of the Spectre Knight. Let's go, and then this is locked, defeat Spectre Knight. Gotcha. Let's go to the pond. Who has awakened me, mortal? Dost thou need aid? Aid me. I sense a trowpel chalice. I can fill it with magical ichor. That's pronounced Icor. Oh. I mean, I appreciate the, the help, but I I thought it was Icor. Icor? Okay, well, give me some Icor. Choose your Icor wisely. Refills health and magic. Become invincible for 10 seconds. Absorb nearby treasures for 60 seconds. Give me the heal. Very well, mortal, what of your second chalice? Invincible. Subjects anew initiate joins us. The ceremony shall commence. Well shoveled night return if thou dost need my aid again. Do not sully our waters with thy filthy body. Next time I won't be so merciful. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Sorry about that. Does he have a leaf in his ass? No, he is a a fish apple. A fapple. That's a much better name than Trowple. <laughs> Press it, it will show any musical sheets there if you've collected them. I forgot what button it is. Uh, X. Yeah, oh, oh god, there's three. We have a lot to do in the village and we're gonna go back to it though. You are right, info and totals. There's one in the, in the pond. Alright, let's do the Lich Yard. Lich, pronounced like itch. The game is good, but it doesn't really get better than this, says Nydra. <laughs> oh, yes, Fapple. Um, as we begin the Lich Yard here, if anyone has any recommendations for audio balancing, let me know. If you want it louder, let me know in chat. Please. Yes or no. Because I, uh, what the heck? I see. bounce on their freaking heads. You're an enemy, though. What the heck? I guess I should probably kill you. Whoa! 
I see. I thought that the, um, I had to, I had to, oh my god, don't hit him when they're electric. I thought these things would hurt me, but no, you can just jump on them as they move up. Gotcha. Careful, this is an evil pile. I think I failed. I think you're supposed to jump on the evil pile? Oh no, you can bounce on these things. I have no idea what's happening, okay? We'll figure it out. 250% louder, says Nambi. Ah! I doubt that. No! Oh! Hold on, I, I need to I need to reload the room, because I, I know I've already failed one of the uh, puzzles. Also, I'm just taking a buttload of damage. Right here? Ah, yeah, that one. And probably one on the right now that I think about it, but I don't think I can get back up there. You know? Gotcha. Hmm, I wonder how we get up there. <laughs> There's so many areas where I'm like, how do you get up there? But I know how you get up there. How you get up there is you uh, either bounce on enemies' heads, or you, ah! You either bounce on enemies' heads, or you don't destroy the block, and you use the block to jump on them. Hey, Seagus Jr., welcome. How are you doing today? Welcome to Shovel Knight. Are you a Shovel Knight? Should probably uh, not anger the... Oh, come back down here. Should probably not anger the dudes. The weird electric frogs. The electric frog. Heel man, no, he's called Shovel Knight. <laughs> Who needs to heal? Oh, oh god. I'm not a fan of this, admittedly. Not only from just the perspective, personally, of just liking to be able to see what's happening, but also I assume other people would also like to see what's happening. You are a cute ghost. We've got a, a boo here. I apologize for the screen shake. <laughs> Not screen shake, but uh, bright flashes everywhere. Maybe you don't have to actually push the bomb anywhere, because you can always hit the skull in order to pop it open. Seafish Roll says, this is probably my second favorite song in the OST. Really? Because so far, you son of a gun. Ah! Got your head. So far, I think that, uh, I prefer the first soundtrack song to this one. But, you know, I'm just getting into it here. Hey, give me my money. Thank you. So we want to do this, 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 boom, boom. Oh god. I'm very apologetic for the uh, the screen flashing. <laughs> I'm just gonna try to get out of the room as quickly as I can. It's a terrible mechanic. Something tells me. Oh. Wasn't this in uh, one of the recent Mario games? A platform that was just like this? Got him. It's interesting that the enemies also trigger the uh, platforms as well. I think you can reduce it in some of the settings. Screen flash. Yeah, we'll put that one on minimal. That seems like a good one. Joust as colors. We'll put that one on standard. Thank you. 
Well, I mean, it it does reduce the flashiness of it, but it is it does still flash. But I guess because it is a game mechanic, they can't just like completely remove it, can they? If only though. At least we did reduce it. Oh, I need you to be here. Hey, come here. What the hell? How do we... Uh, I'm holding down! Can you... Okay, you know what? Maybe I need you to come... Hey, you, come over here. Why are you not moving? There we go. Oh, move down. I don't even know why I'm doing this. It doesn't look like there's any like real super special loot. Oh no, there is. Some, there's something here. Maybe this is the direction I'm supposed to be going in? I don't know, okay? Also, all of a sudden we're in Rogue Legacy. Do, 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 do. Did Abe just grave rob that ghost? Oh, absolutely. And I'll do it again, damn it. Oh, we should have bounced. We should have stayed up there when we bounced on his head. We're gonna have to do this level again. Rip me, man. Rip me. Rip me. Rip me, brother. It's a ghost. See ya. Hey, at least we did find one musical sheet, so we don't have to completely do all of this again. Hey, get out of here. Ah! No! I got it. They died, but they did kind of like come back to life. What the heck? <laughs> um, was there anything there that we needed? Nope. All right, I didn't expect to be able to uh, completely break <laughs> the, the level and go off the screen, but that's kind of cool. See ya. Whoa, 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 whoa. Got a golden trout. How do we get out of this room? Oh, that did not work. Oh, no. I've hit a puzzle. Oh, no. The secret is just go through the ground. Should probably kill the giant demon instead of worrying about the money, but it's okay. Or could just re-enter the room because the enemies reset. Actually, uh, not all of the enemies reset when you leave a room and enter. That's why I didn't do it there. But I should at least try it. You're you're not wrong. this, by the way. They're not making it easy, are they? Uh-oh. For a second there, I thought I completely, like, just eliminated my chance of success. Destroyed a secret. Don't break it, don't break. This is no place for the living mortal. You shall be summoned when it is your time. And everyone has a time as we saw with your beloved shield knight. 
Lies! I won't believe such talk from phantoms. Your very existence is a vile deception. <laughs> the Enchantress is just full of surprises. She granted me new life. So that I may take yours! Okay, maybe don't jump into him. I fought death in uh, Dead Cells. I can fight you. Maybe. Ow. You think I can, like, knock his scepter away? I keep trying to bounce off of it. It's probably not a good idea. Nope, yeah, you can't bounce off of it. <laughs> You've given me dudes? Rude. Got him. Bounce on his freaking head. Can't help but feel like this fight might take a while. Especially if I don't actually try to be super aggressive against him. Oh, every time! Alright, hold on. Um. Refills all HP. That's not how you use it! Health upgrades one. How do you. I don't know how you use them. <laughs> how do you use equipment? <laughs> Yo, why does why do some of the lights light up bigger than the other lights? That's an interesting one. Up and attack. So you hold on. Ah, I see. Item in the upper screen, and then up. Okay, I I maybe understand. I don't know. We'll see. I also change it to Y. That would just be convenient, I feel. In my mind. It's probably one of those situations where you don't get all your all of your money back, if I had to guess. I wanted to jump on your head, you stupid dumb boss. Ugly and your red coat is stupid. Also, he hit me just by, like, immediately move. Ah! Freaking jerks. This fight seems long. Oh, and I'm realizing now, I see that the jars represent your ability to cast a spell. So, but it wasn't, no, it wasn't an S, no, we don't have it, okay. The potion is a one-time use only, you gotta go back to the fish man to get a new one, but if we had a spell, it would cost jars. We're learning, we're learning. We're figuring out the mechanics as we go. Turn around, Shovel Knight. You, you gotta attack in the right direction, my dude. Why, why stand there and get hit multiple times, you know? I just gotta, I just gotta ask why. Hey, you know what would make this fight better? <laughs> Not being able to see. Whatever. Look, I'm not trying to flawless this, I'm just trying to kill you. <laughs> Sir Xerox, welcome! Hello! Yeah, I figured I was taking longer than <laughs> ideal, but it's my first time fighting the boss.
Are we dreaming? Is this real life? Is this just fantasy? No, no dream that night, okay. Oh, he's chasing us down. Um, but there is a there was a lot there that we can still do. Now that I kind of maybe understand the secrets of of what I've missed. But let's go to the forest of phasing. What is the forest of phasing? Yikes, spikes, if only I could phase away to safety, I could cross and get so much treasure. Well, I'll see you later, dude. Oh, you want a rematch? Okay, fine, we'll rematch. I didn't realize they could dive bomb. Hey, come here. Need my money? Give me my money. Okay. <laughs> Luckily, you're invincible while you're getting your cash. Your cash on. See ya. See ya. Oh, it, it's not a boss fight, it's just, hey, a very tiny little room encounter. Okay, okay. Hello, I'm back. Something tells me. Is there a dash mechanic? No. Something tells me there is a, a bunch more secrets here. Hey, friend. Whoa, you've got musical sheets. Can you, I give you a bunch of money. Dead crowd jokes, says I. Lesson learned, never crack jokes in a graveyard. Never, ever. Now that I have this music sheet, I can perform, perform it anytime you want. Hold on. Now I'm just asking myself, who can I jump on to get across this gap? We're gonna have to get an ability that lets us get across. This is how we would recharge, I think. It's my uh, my assumption. Should come by and visit. I want to get onto the roof. I think there's something in one of these trees. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, decisions, decisions. Why not buy a meal ticket? I mean, I will. And we have plenty of money. We can come down here and buy some sort of an upgrade. Hey, blue guy. I would like, ooh, a uh, phase locket. Okay, I figure we should probably buy both of these. Hold up an X, escape from all harm briefly. You can even walk on spikes. Oh, ooh, crap. No, that's achievements. An orb of boundless combat potential. Okay. There's something there. I was just gonna say, I found it! Okay, so it's just a little blob that bounces around. Um, check out this one. No, check out this one. For eight, you phase. Can't jump on that. What does that mean phase? I'm going to, oh, you just buy max mana. Okay, so you, you spend the meal ticket here and her you just pay the money directly. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll give you the meal ticket then. Shoulder buttons for quick swap. You're not wrong! Thank you. I didn't look at what the food was. It's probably all unique food, too.
Okay, so it is really just very temporary invincibility. Still, 